going really good. Good. Oh, I did it again. Man, my glasses are all steamed up. All right, all right. Oh, does that smell good? And nothing has burnt on the bottom, except for my fingers trying to get it out of here. Oh, let's get it on top of the stove. Bring it up there. We're going to cool it down. And as long as this is already heated up, I'm going to put this in. And bring the temperature up to 400 degrees from 350. And we'll check it out in just a little bit. So while everything is cooking here, we have the squash and the cauliflower. Over here, we just pulled this out of the oven. And just like we do out in the gastrodome, kids, you got to take some good old tin foil and cover this up. It's just going to be resting here. There's no heat on the burners at all. It's just resting, so we're just tempting it so those juices would flow. Whoa! I'll tell you what, the muffins already smell like they're cooking, so just sit back in just a little bit. Now that is what a muffin man should look like. Yeah, boy, these are looking really good. Just gonna go around this. Oh, they're so slippery. You don't even have to do that. Oh man, look at this. Look at that. It's perfect. Oh, you know what? Nothing says love them like something from the oven. Look at that. Oh, that is phenomenal. And nothing's really burnt in there. I think the olive oil works, kids. But you know what? Just watch that little thing on uh, the Muffin Man. And I'm just wondering, who is the Muffin Man? Who is the Muffin Man? Kids are going to put this in the middle of this, so I think I better put that in the middle of that. And you know what? We got some great muffins. Look at this compared to the last muffins. Oh, got. those look a zillion percent better. Okay, grab one. Oh, and they some more. Oh yeah. Put that off to the side. And I just wanted to let you know that. Uh, yeah, that's something that we did a little while ago. Oh, yeah. With Bella. Mm-hmm. And uh, is this where the gingerbread man lives? Uh, I really can't tell you where the gingerbread man lives. You can't. I'm sorry. I just, I promised him I can't tell you where the gingerbread <laughs> man lives. But that's okay. I'm good. I'm good with this. So let's get eaten on this and see how you like this. Okay, and what? Uh, and this is. This is the good squash that I put together with some cauliflower. Part? Yes. And what is this? That is a good piece of pork. I guess I should wait before I. Why? She dies. <laughs> I put a little bit of squash on it. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were going to pass out there for a second. No, nice and yeah. tender. Okay, alright. Let's try that out. I told the kids that if they wanted to, they could actually use this for bacon. Mm -hmm. Wrap this around some meat and put it in the oven. It's already been cooked, of course. Wrap what? this around some meat and put it in the oven and cook it. Wrap what around the meat? This, this beautiful sauce. This stuff? Yeah. Puree? Yeah. Puree. Oh, puree, puree. That's very good. And you say you've got cauliflower in here too? Mm-hmm. Well, the um, squash, I assume it's butternut squash. 
Okay, good. Okay, now it's time for the muffins. And I wonder where the muffin man is. <laughs> the one who lives in Drury Lane? No! The muffin man does not live on Drury Lane. Well, that's what the song used to say. Mm -hmm. You're good. What? Very good. What a difference. Bella and I made that two times. Everything is in here. I put uh, dried fruit in here. I put uh, apples in here. Ugh, man, you could That's taste very it. good. The only thing that I didn't put in here was the uh, the chocolate peanut butter. And I don't know. Oh, I don't think that. I don't think I miss it. Mm -hmm. No, this is good. It's so good. Mm. You don't already. Oh, no, I don't need a whole lot. No, I don't either, but not that So we'll see you next time, kids, on Uncle Tom's Kitchen.